Hey guys, today we're gonna to be talking about my personal journey with weight loss and some information about me and hopefully it can help y'all get on y'all path and we can grow as a family. All right, let's get right into it, shall we? Uh, where to begin? Well, I started when my first year of college. I met one of my closest friends now. We had just met and we decided to work out together. That year started with a bang. I went from doing nothing at all to every day that I'm at college, going to the gym. My college has a, my local college has a gym. I went there every day for an hour doing some cardio while I wait for my friends to get out of class. And then we just start lifting weights and it went really well from there. I went from going to like 250 to about 230 to 220s maybe. But then I fell off the bandwagon and I started gaining that weight back again. Slowly but surely as I stopped going to the gym as often, stopped eating healthy, stopped paying attention to what I eat and only ate when I was hungry. Uh, I fell into a little dark rut for a while with my emotions where I would just eat to feel better and I knew it was wrong so I wanted to stop. Years later, just didn't work out for me until I got married. And I started realizing, yo, I have a wife now. I need to take better care of myself, not only for my health, but also because I want to be there in the long run for her. And y'all have all met her. She's been on the channel as Mandy. And so I decided to bulk it down, think about what I really wanted to do in my life. I came to the conclusion to joining the military. Started working out with them, going to my local recruitment office. Every Tuesday we had workouts. I think it was Tuesday and Thursday, but because of my job, I can only make Tuesdays. Once I started doing that and I started sharing with my friends and my family, like we got these workout routines that we do at the recruitment office. I really wanted to share some of it with y'all. I know some of my friends and family wanted to get into shape as well. It was fun for me, like working out every week and I started doing it on my own time. It was really fun. Although I did, I did hit a bump after that session of working out with the Army Recruitment where I was informed that due to my hearing condition that I will not be able to join the army and I did fall into a slight depression but I took away from this now that I was more physically stronger but I was also mentally stronger where my hiccups I see as opportunity now and the joy I got out of getting my friends and family together to work out and the joy that it brought me to see how hard they were working and to see the progression that they made on their own is thanks to me just helping them get on the right path. All glory to God, of course. He constructs everything in our lives. And he really did. He really was working on my life. And with that, that feeling of, honestly, this pride and joy from seeing my friends and family around me do better, I have come to the conclusion that I would be interested in being a personal trainer. I would be interested in being a personal trainer for anybody who could not afford it, anybody who who just need a support group that is reasonable, and I, I would just feel happy to help those who would want to lose weight. Now, I did come to this conclusion. I am going to college for it, online college, um, Penn Foster. I am going there. I'm hoping to get my, my certification sometime this year. Uh, Lord willing. I am currently sitting at 250 because of my emotional eating, but I have found new resolve and I'm hoping to bring it to anybody who wants to go on this journey with me in losing weight. My goal for this year is to just rewrite my mind to where I'm not overeating just because I'm emotional or bored, but that I'm eating for fuel and staying consistent with my physical workout. Tonight, we will also be going to the gym. Me, my sister, and my wife, they are interested in working out and bettering themselves as well. And with that, I thank y'all for listening. And tell us how you feel at the gym. Well, I feel kind of hyper and pumped. Um, I usually use 17 and a half. Um, I usually do about 20 minutes. I'm at 20, so I hope I can survive. What about you? <laughs> Thank you.
All right, Mandy, how do you feel after that gym workout? Well, um, I feel kind of uh, sore a little bit. My arms hurt, and um, my legs hurt too. And we just came from uh, workout any time. And it for seven. And uh, yeah, um, I feel good only because I like the way my body has changed. And that is, that is what my goal is trying to. Um, have a muscular, athletic body. And uh, yeah, I feel good. Feel good. You want some words, Lily? <laughs>